Heard you got a spot on the night shift. Hola, Guerrilla. Hola. Lailo, go! We place explosives here, here, and here. Speech starts, charges detonate, we create a ring of fire around that hotel hotter than the devil's asshole. Which means? Castillo's forces can get out and reinforcements can get in. With Danny right in the middle. And then what? Danny kills El Presidente. It's beautiful. Hey, Danny. Danny! Look at that sexy Supremo! You want me to kill Anton Castillo? Today. Anton is giving his annual Independence Day speech at the Hotel Paraiso. Live. Juan has intel on the exact location of his security detail. One in a million opportunity. We're gonna cut the head off the snake and make boots from his skin. Mierda. And you're good with this. Kill a dictator who has raped our land and turned our people into slaves? Thinking about it. What about you? Never killed a president before. What? It's an assassination, Danny! It's guerrilla meth! Christ, I need a shower. And you need this. You're gonna be a fucking guerrilla legend! I'll call you! <laughs> He's too excited. He's right. Kill Castillo and Libertad will rise in the chaos. And after that, who knows? Who knows? Go put that come mierda down. Viva Libertad! at checkpoints. Find the generators. They pop real nice. Okay, okay. How do I trigger them? You don't. Clara and I have guerrillas out planting bombs all over Esperanza. It will be a Semtex symphony. You are on the tuba, and I am the conductor. Vamos, Dani. De pinga. I can't keep up with your metaphors.
Paradise comes at a cost. A 
Target, find them. Home in place. Juan, the packages have been dropped off. You sound like a fucking postman. Just say A1, I planted the bombs. I sent you a photo of where you can find me. On my way. I'm on the rooftops in front of the hotel. If you forget what I'm like, just look for the father figure you always wish you had. I think you mean drunk uncle, Juan. Hey, I'm six hours sober. Don't jinx it. He's working hard to serve you. Government. <laughs> 
of a criminal offense may not access social services prior to an investigation and official BDP clearance. Getting close to Juan. Bombs are in place, Juan. Yours were the last. Can you feel it? That moment of serenity before a lot of assholes are going to die. Time for my three favorite words. Trigger the explosives. PTSD for everyone. Go, Danny. Secure the hotel and kill Anton. Don't come back without Castillo's balls. I'm going to cast them in bronze. Tell me of a dream he had. Yeah. Hey, uh, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on. 
are you talking about? She's exploding, his bodyguards are getting murdered, and he's still giving that stupid speech. A man has some cojones. Why don't you bring them to me? To rebuild our lives is a great success. We are producing a cancer treatment the world is desperate for. The demand for Vibiro has never been high. We have already begun to consult the past but looks to the future. We have found a path to paralyze. And yet once again, another, another group of terroristas, another pack of fake Yarens. Libertad is nothing but a cancer from within who want to burn everything we've built to the ground. But now, the stakes are much higher. For the fake Yarens are not just a threat to me or you. They are a threat to you. Fox. It's locked! When you elected the enemy, you elected the truth. And the truth is There are no second chances. Libra must produce Viviro. And only Viviro. More Viviro than ever before. And if we allow these terroristas to distract us, there is only one destination. Failure. Collapse. for the penthouse. My true Yarens, today marks over 100 years of independence for our country. It marks a day Yara stood together with one voice and demanded freedom from his Spanish oppressors. It was a day of bloodshed, of revolution. A revolution that proclaimed to our colonizers, we are not your servants, we are not your toys, we are Yara. This revolution gave us our freedom, but it also gave us something else, something we are afraid to admit. It gave us an addiction to chaos. The word revolution became an excuse for some Yaras to act on their wildest impulses, to indulge their selfish desires, to embrace chaos. Mi papa called them fake Yaras. I am old enough to remember a Yara before 1967. Back then... I see you! Time to catch that elevator. Hands around our throat. The Yankees were begging to come to our island, drink our rum, dance with our women. Mi papa welcomed the world.
Danny, what's happening? Are you inside? I'm inside. Do you see Anton? Danny! There's nobody here. Clara, I think the speech was a recording. It's a setup. Anton's soldiers are coming for you. Get out of there. You were the one who got me on that boat. You should be dead. I was the lucky one. What's your name? Danny, and you? You know who I am. You are here to kill my father. Last I checked, you were trying to get the fuck away from your papa. I shouldn't have done that. Why? Because you were the lucky one. He's a monster, Diego. He was raised that way. And you won't be! You are not going to kill me! Depends if you fire that thing again. If I run, he finds me. If he finds me, Yaren gets hurt. Don't you get it? He'll never let me leave. How old are you again? Do you have family? No. You're looking for one Chamaco. You should leave Yara. He won't stop till all of you are gone. Mierda. Keep your head down. This way. Fucking dictators. Gracias. Hey, Danny. My papa is sick. That's why he's not here. Coño, he's beautiful. Don't mind if I do, Castillo. Clara, I made it out in one piece. It was a setup, but I got myself a little present. Castillo's right. Smells like old dictator. We didn't get Castillo, but we did some damage to his regime. Damage? You punched Anton's regime in the balls today. Go buy yourself a cerveza. You earned it. Hey, you ever hear anything about Castillo being sick? No, why? Uh, I overheard some guards. Neighborhood. 